Hello, I'm Julie and this is Louisa and we're going to be doing some yoga dance with you. So some yoga moves, some breath work, some warming up, some warming down, lots of dancing. So enjoy. First of all, we're going to warm ourselves up. So standing up, find a space where you're not going to knock anything over and standing up nice and tall. Lift up your toes, spread your toes wide, press them down into the ground. And close your eyes, breathe in and out through the nose. Big deep breaths all the way down to the tummy. And then opening your eyes, we're going to start to swing those arms forwards and backwards, little bounces with the knees, and then bring your breath in with your movement. So making your movement bigger now, breathing in as we raise the arms and out as we drop the arms down and then widen your stance. So take your feet a little bit further apart and begin to lower your head down as you drop the arms down. Couple more here. And then stretch up, lift up onto your tiptoes and relax, let's sway the arms from side to side. As you twist, lifting up the heel at the back and just allowing your arms to flap around, just let them fly freely. And we're going to start reaching up to the two sides now. So we're reaching across the body, little bends in the knees as you move from side to side and then reaching down your feet as though you're picking flowers and we're going to do one up and one down one up and one down one more time and then we're switching sides reach lift and coming back to center now shaking your hands out shake your arms shake your legs Feet, shake your whole body. I'm standing still now, mountain pose. Big breaths again. In and out through your nose, standing tall. Open your eyes. And we're all ready to go. So here we go. The first part to our yoga dance, which has been set to the song A Million Dreams from the film The Greatest Showman. I'm going to hand over to Louisa to give you the instructions. We're going to do the first part and then we'll do another video for you to learn the second part. At the end of this video, we uh, come to a point where the, in the music it uh, repeats itself. So you can then repeat the whole section again. We'll just give you a reminder of that at the end. So, over to you, Louisa. Okay, thank you, Julie. So, um, at the beginning of the dance, we take our right arm first. We are stood in parallel. The hand goes all the way up to the ceiling. That's four counts. The left one then comes up to join it for another four counts. We bring the arms down into prayer pose for four counts. And we do a little turn. So, I prefer to put my foot behind and do a turn, but you can turn however you like. And bring the arms down after the turn. We'll then repeat that with the left arm. So the left arm comes up, the right arm comes up, arms down and turn the opposite way to how we went before. We're then going to take the right leg out into the warrior two pose. So that is a lunge with the arms straight. So make sure you're making a straight line. That's one, two. We're going to lean over for three, four, stretch back up five, six, in for seven, eight. Then repeat it on the other side. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So back in parallel. Next, we're going to shoot the right arm out to the side. The left arm then goes out to the left. We step to the left and swing it around and face the back. Then the words of the song, he then goes crazy. So we bring our hands up to our heads and do a crazy head roll. We then repeat what we've just done. So the right arm goes out first, left arm, swing, and then turn. Carry on turning the way to make a full circle. 
Once you've come round, do another head roll. So we've repeated that section. The chorus, we bring the right foot up, so like a tree pose, but parallel. The arms go up at the same time. This foot then comes out to a lunge and the arms come down with it. We then bring the left arm, a left leg in and do the same to that side. And we do that four times, so two to each side. And number four. From here, the right foot swings through and the arms stay there. And we then step it out and go into the starfish. Forward fold, back to starfish. We then bring the left knee in and pull the arms in to a contraction and stretch back up. We do it the other way, contract and stretch up. Bring the feet into parallel as you bring it into the middle. Step out to the side and do a half moon. You can keep the foot on the floor if you'd like, or you can lift it, because we're gonna hold that there for quite a while. We then bring it back down, back into parallel, and we start the sequence again. So the music repeats, that's a verse and a chorus. We then repeat to the next verse and the next chorus. Okay, so we've repeated the first section twice. We finish in our half moon, either lifted or on the floor. We're gonna come back to the middle, and start from the bridge when the woman starts singing in the song. So we turn to the left with the arms at right angles. And as you get round, you twist like earlier on in the dance. We then turn to the other side and twist. The foot that's out, we're gonna cross it over and stretch. So this is really slow, so you can take your time on this big stretch. And then we repeat it again, cross over and stretch. From here, we're going to step the foot that's out the right foot forwards and do a big up and back. Then with the other foot, we step up and back. We don't hold it there for very long. The arms then swing all the way through and stretch up. We then bring the right arm down, so we loosen the right arm, big stretch over, back up, stretch down and back up. We then swing it through, swing and up. Bring the hands down in front of our eyes. And then the right arm comes up first, left arm next. Bring them both in together and then repeat it going up, two. And there's a big bit in the music where we do a big spin around. As many spins as you like, back to face the front. And so then the chorus again is exactly the same apart from the very first bit of the chorus is really quiet. So we do this move again, but we do it really slow. So we only do two instead of four. And the chorus is all the same from here. So stretch up, forward fold, stretch up, bring it in and up, bring it in and up, bring it in. And then we do the half moon. This time we don't lift the foot off the floor, we hold it there, not for very long because we're going to do a squat and we're going to do it to the other side. With the foot that's out, we're going to do four slow walks in a circle. So one walk, then to the back, then to the side, then to the front, bringing the arms slowly down. We then lunge forwards. You can hold it here if you like. If you would like to lift your foot off the floor, you can. Hold it there, and this end bit is really slow, so you can just take your time and finish it in whatever position you would like. All right. Okay, got that? Thank you. Thank you very much, Louisa. I close my eyes and I can see a world that's waiting for me, and I call my own. Through the dark, through the door, through where no one's been before, but it feels like home. They can say, they can say it all sounds crazy. They can say, they can say you lost my life. 
special things I compile, each one there to make you smile on a rainy day. They can say, they can say it all sounds crazy. They can say, they can say we've lost our minds. I don't care, I don't care if they call us crazy. to the floor. If you have a mat, then lie yourself down on your exercise mat. If you don't, then that doesn't matter at all. Just find a really nice, comfortable place to lie down and stretch your arms out behind you. Stretch your toes out. Full body stretch. And then let's bend the knees. Bring the knees into the chest. Lift your head up to your knees. And then let go of one of your legs. Doesn't matter which one. Stretch that out, and then we'll cross over. Stretch the other leg out, and bring both knees in again. Have a little rock from side to side, and then bring your knees all the way over to one side, and then stretch your arm out in the other direction and look that way if you can. And take three deep breaths here. Bring your knees back to the centre and then move your legs all the way into the opposite direction. Stretch your arm out at shoulder height. Look over to your hand. Take three deep breaths here. And bring your knees back to centre. Take your hands behind your knees and rock yourself up and down three times, two, three. See if you can balance on that third time. You can maybe let go of your legs into boat pose. And then cross your legs over and sit yourself up. Placing your hands on your knees there. Take some deep breaths in. And then we're going to bring ourselves onto our hands and our knees and bring our head down to the ground. And this is called child's pose. And so just rest there for a moment. Lifting up your head, walk your hands back. 
breathe in. Lift your arms up to the side, reach up, hands together, lower the hands down, press the hands into each other at the heart space. Sit up nice and tall, breathe deeply. And breathe out through the mouth this time. And opening those eyes, shake your hands out, and we're all done. Have a brilliant day. See you soon. Thank you. Bye.